Christmas is around the corner. Mm -hmm. Any special plans you have for the holidays? Um, I'm going to just be home for the holidays. You know, I wasn't home for Thanksgiving, so I'm going to definitely be home for Christmas. Kick with my family. We're going to Africa, like, the day after Christmas, so we'll be flying there. We're doing a show in Nigeria. So my mom coming with me, you know what I'm saying? She's like automatically had to come to Africa. So we going there, and then I think we're going to go to Dubai after that. And so the holidays, we like going to be jet setting, man. Do you buy a lot of gifts for your family at Christmas? Are you big on Yeah, hell yeah. Well, I told my mom I wasn't getting her anything else for Christmas because I got her a house and a car and my dad a car and um, what else? You know, they don't need anything else. Man. And she's going to Africa, so it's like... She don't need a goddamn thing, man. And um, well, but I got my family everything, and I'm still gonna get him something anyway. But um, yeah, just everybody, my whole crew, we all got special gifts, things planned, so it's gonna be awesome. Do you have a favorite Christmas song? Favorite Christmas song? Um, Christmas in Harlem. It's my favorite Christmas song. That's a good one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and Hall of Fame. Early yes. Next year. Hall of Fame early next year. Do you have an exact date here? Um, we do have an exact date, but I can't say it yet, man. All right, but it's coming early next year. Um, I'm excited about it. I'm excited to put, like, the new songs out, new singles, new everything, man. It's just it's going to be something that people... I feel like, um, you know, the vlogs I've been doing where I've been talking about, like, reality, imagination, um, a lot of the album has that same touch, taste, and tone of just, like, being super inspirational super intellectual and of course it still got bangers on there too you know what i'm saying it still got um it's, a, it's like an emotional roller coaster man you like happy hype as hell sad as hell real shit motivational shit you know so it's just it's it's a great body of work so i'm excited about it have you chosen the next single Nah, but we got it though i just haven't chose which one i'm gonna do okay. yeah it's gonna be a different completely different from like guap or any of the mixtape stuff any like you know, anything like that. So it's going to be something very serious. It's really what I wanted to be the first single, but um, Guap was something I, I'm happy about too, but that was everybody, we decided to Guap, but what I wanted to do, people didn't think it would be good first, but we're going to get to it. Any collaborations you can give us from the, on Hall of Fame? Um, collaborations on Hall of Fame include, well, Janae Aiko's on there. Um... James Fauntleroy is on there. He was on the, like the beginning of Click, and he was on my song 100 on my mixtape with me and Kendrick Lamar and Royce. Uh, James is on there, and he's a part of Cocaine 80s. Um, who else? You know, I mean, of course you got the good music fam on there. Um, there's some good features on there, man. I don't want to give them all away, but it's good. It's gonna be it's gonna be a hell of a fucking album, man, for real. 2013 is around the corner. Do you have mm -hmm. a New Year's resolution? New Year's resolution? Um, remain sucker free. Um, you know, I got a lot of New Year's resolutions. Every time I write New Year's resolutions down, I get them done. So I'm going to make sure I write them all out. I haven't really thought about them too much, but the year is like two weeks away, man. That's something to really sit down and think about and get together. But I really want, one thing I want to do the most is inspire. And I think people are starting to see that, especially through these video vlogs I do. And once I release the new album, um, you know, I think that's something that's going to be way more evident and clear. And a lot of my songs, even with my first album, they didn't really teach too much. You know what I'm saying? It had some meaningful stuff on there, but I didn't get a chance to teach. And if you look at people like Bob Marley or even Tupac or Ye and Jay, and, you know, they've taught in their own ways. I want to make sure I teach and um, leave a legacy. So... That's definitely going to be evident and clear for 2013.